Hi there everyone, welcome to Technoholic. In this video, we will talk about how we can migrate or update Windows PowerShell from 5.1 to PowerShell 7. So let's see how we can do that. For that, let's click here on this menu button and then I'm going to type PowerShell. Now we need to type following command and then hit enter which will basically let you know the major and minor version of this PowerShell. So here we can see complete information about this PowerShell and if I see here the current latest version of PowerShell is PowerShell 7. Now let's click here on download PowerShell and not to worry guys I'm gonna provide all these links in the description of this video. From there you can directly reach to these pages and can download. Now let me go down here. And now here since I'm using Windows, I'm going to download this Windows 64-bit version of .msi variant. Now let's click here. And there we go. We are about to download this latest PowerShell. And now I'm going to simply install it. Now let's click here on launch new PowerShell and then let's click finish here. And there we go guys. Now here we can see now the latest PowerShell version is 7.4.3. And let me again check the version here by running the same command. And there we go guys. And if we talk about the difference between PowerShell 5.1 versus PowerShell 7.4.3. Then the biggest one is in terms of performance, PowerShell 5.1 was slower and was launched in August 2016. However, PowerShell 7.4.3 was launched in July 2023. And then the .NET dependency with PowerShell 5.1 was .NET framework. However, the new PowerShell was based on .NET Core up to 7.0. If you want to know more about this PowerShell version, then I'm gonna attach this GitHub page link also in the description of this video. I hope guys you find this video helpful and informational. If so, then please do like and subscribe to Technoholic to see more such content. And I will catch you soon with one such another video. Till then, you take care and bye-bye.